Damn, you know, I was making jokes all the time in Persona 4 that Dojima was the best father in the world. Or best father of the year. Damn, Sojiro takes the fucking cake, dude. Holy shit, even though he's not your dad. Well, actually, he does have a kid, but, like, oh, God. He's, don't worry, he lightens up, but he's definitely the new father of the year. Oh, look at that cardboard box that's full of the DLC slash money I blew on this game. <laughs> Let's take a look around, shall we? God, look at this. There's shit everywhere. <laughs> yeah, probably. Oh, what's in here? Uh, what's over here? Jesus Christ. I like what Gordon Ramsay says on his fucking on Hell's Kitchen. You know, there's just crap on top of crap on top of crap on top of crap. <laughs> that's my bed? <laughs> <laughs> nice. I'm just gonna check this one place really quick. I will need this desk. I will need this desk. I know, this, this place is fucking filthy. Well, might as well just start cleaning. <laughs> Damn, I really should take a book from this guy. Like, take a page from this guy's book. Like, I barely clean my fucking room, dude. It's actually quite a shame. Alright. Well, that was pretty easy. I mean, it's a freaking attic, so there's like dust everywhere. Oh, well, I mean, that's a little bit better. Seriously? <laughs> what? Thought I was making a ruckus, like breaking shit? You're actually a good kid. Not gonna lie, you're actually a good kid. No, <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna head back then. Yeah, you're fine, fine. You're not my mom. You're, you're not my parent. You're not actually my dad. I can do whatever the hell I want. But then the game is telling me. I guess I might as well just go to bed. <laughs> you go to sleep. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, I can't. Wait. Oh god! That's a great meme in this game. Yeah, exactly. It's like, believe it or not, he actually has good morals, and he's actually a good guy. But no, man. You'll, you'll, you'll learn more about this later on, though. This is just giving you a little preview. Just get in the car. Stop it! Hmm? How dare you cross me? Yeah, I know. He's clearly inebriated. Help! Please stop! Yeah, exactly. Well, it doesn't mean it doesn't matter what you pick because you know you're actually a good guy. <clears throat> what a waste of time! You think you're worth causing me trouble, huh? Uh, I'll call the police. Call them if you want. The police are my bitches. They're not gonna take you seriously. No! Stop! Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car! Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. What are you looking at? Get out of my face! This ain't a show. Get lost, kid! See, this is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car. I'm pretty sure we see more of it as it goes on, but basically, the bottom of the line is you kind of just tap him lightly, and he literally just falls over and sues you. Yeah, and it pretty he pretty much fucked up your life. I'm just gonna let you know that right now. It's a pretty cool icon. I totally would. Uh, I, uh, I dig it, but uh, you know, let, let, let's just delete all our problems away. Oh, might as well just go to sleep. 
With no covers on or anything? I mean, it's still springtime. I mean, it's probably decent weather, right? Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. So you've come to, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight! Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. Oh, <laughs> Dude, I don't give a shit about any of those right now. Just get me out of here! Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. <laughs> are you effing kidding me? <laughs> Worry not, there is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated. Rehabilitated toward freedom. That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? Wait, what? You didn't decline. Hmm. Very well, that is enough. Allow me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justine. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like. The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. Time's up! Now hurry up and go back to sleep! Jesus Christ, I'm... <laughs> The go to sleep meme is everywhere, dude. Oh my god, oh god, just, just fucking listen to this real quick. Oh my god! I don't know what it is though, just the sound of a knife piercing the calendar. Oh my god! It's, god, it's just- it's- oh my god! Like I said, I just love everything about this game. Well... The school you're attending is in the Aoyama district. Oh, thanks. Jeez. <laughs> well, at least we know he's straight. Yeah, Sojiro goes off on that a lot in this game. It's because he loves women! <laughs> Do 
Do me a favor and behave yourself, all right? Don't get me wrong. I don't care what happens to you. Best dad of the year. Just don't cause me any trouble. Yeah, seriously, what the fuck, dude? What kind of guardian says that? To reiterate, just so we're clear, you will immediately be expelled if you cause any problems. Honestly, I hesitated on accepting someone like you. But there were some circumstances on our side. You might have done a variety of things in hiding in your hometown, but you will behave yourself here. If you are thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. <laughs> That's my wife who is a teacher! <laughs> okay, God. God, snap out of it, you fucking autist Jesus. Here's your student ID. Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. That is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa? Mm-hmm. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. It was a sudden transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, please keep a close eye on him. Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well, I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. <sighs> Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. Oh god, it's like a dream come true. <laughs> Just have Michelle Ruff as your teacher. Well, what do you expect? I mean, I mean, look, like, <clears throat> you as a criminal kid coming to school, what do you think everyone's gonna assume? Oh my god, he's a fucking, he's a killer. He's like, he has like a criminal record. He, I hope he doesn't like backstab me or anything. Jesus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just, I'll, yeah, I'll think I'll scrape by. <laughs> what the hand? Get the hand behind the neck and everything. Hell yeah, dude. Hey. Yes, Dad. <laughs> I'm sorry. He's not my dad. My guardian. Or yes, sir. Troublesome situation. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. I would have thought that my volleyball team has contributed more than enough to cover that. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. Remember those words, actually. Just, for, just I'm, I, I'm just gonna point that out. Just remember those words real quick. <clears throat> well, I keep wishing that he just end up not coming to school. Still, that isn't something I should be saying as a teacher. Well, I should be returning to practice. Oh right, the tournament's coming up, isn't it? <laughs> Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team, too. Yes, that's true. Why'd it have to be my class? God, she's not excited to have me? Me? Oh, oh my god. Oh, traffic's not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. So, how was it? The school, I mean. Think you can manage? Nah, we'll see. <laughs> mm. Now listen up, don't even think of doing anything stupid. Still, you were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll in a different one. 
It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. That's what it was like at school. People might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. Wait, so... Honestly, why did you take me in anyway? I was asked to do it, and I just happened to agree to it. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too, after all. Wow, seriously? So he... Wow. What? How did that even work? So, like, what? He just gets paid money? So, like, for all we know, he can literally just dump us out on the street and just be like, okay, not my problem anymore. See ya, I got the money. Again, a subway has derailed at Shibuya Station, greatly affecting the timetable all across the... Oh, another accident. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. from the accident. According to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comments were made. Police are still looking for a plausible motive. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently reported all of this six months ago. The deterioration of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This will go all the way to the top. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? SNN has Everything's linked. That's what you're thinking, correct? Hmm. Oh well. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. I was I was ready to go for this meeting, and that's when this extremely fast train just came crashing in. Oh man, I thought I was gonna die. A noisy subway platform filled with people was suddenly. Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. Conveyor belt only. Ah. Mm, okay, I think that's finally it, right? Oh, thank God. I want to actually do some playing. Jeez. God. God. So. Oh, jeez. How much time will we be able to pass on anyway? Oh, God. Don't. Don't take the piss out on me, dude. Oh, fine. Okay. Oh, is it something nice? Oh, God. Is he finally going to, like, show his nice side? Be father of the year for real? Talk about a gruesome accident. 80 people were involved. It's a diary. Make sure you write in it. You may be under probation, but there's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that is. However, I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry. I'll be there in no time. Uh -huh. I'll see you soon. Well, I'm off. 
I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. You got school tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? So that's pretty much your save point, though. <laughs> I don't have to! God! I should I'm pretty sure you... something. <laughs> I should write something. Oh, God. Did you know that... Like, dude, there's, like, a video on YouTube or something like that that... That had, like, Xander Mobus had, like, at least, like, 15 minutes worth of, like, lines in the game. But, um, yeah. Well, you know, I'm gonna take a little break right now, though, get some water, because uh, I want to keep going, though. I feel like I haven't really done much in these 50 minutes. Well, anyways, see you next time.